Hello, everybody. My name is Kundalina Kutryanskum, and I'm one of the co-authors of the current research, and I will be the presenter. Our paper's name is Application of Image Segmentation, a Medium Filter for White Branches Structure Evaluation. The current paper's general objective is to propose a method for evaluating the structure of Bulgarian white cheese and brine by applying the Statistical Region Merging Algorithm, or SMR for short, and the Medium Filter altogether. The SMR is an algorithm based on region growing and merging techniques. The Medium Filter, however, is a non-linear dynamic system, mainly used for removing noise, noise from images. The main purpose is divided into several steps in which to be accomplished. They are deciding the most suitable value of the Q parameter, using eight different mask sizes of the medium filter, implementing a macro, and performing a statistical analysis in order to be chosen and prefer kernel, that is, the mask size. The first specific objective, which defines the primary aim of the study, is figuring out the best value of Q. This parameter controls the complexity of the SMR algorithm, which determines how much of details of the cheese structure would be visible. Through testing, we have concluded that the most suitable value for Q should be 2, because our aim is to detect areas with approximately uniform structure on the examined surface. Apart from the SMR algorithm, we have decided to use 8 mask sizes of the median filter. The reason why we did that was to examine how the filter affects the coefficient of segmentation with its property of edge preserving smoothing. We did not use the filter in order to reduce the present noise in the images, but more details to be stored out and more wide perception of the specific areas to be depicted. The chosen mask sizes are from 3x3 until 17x17. 17 17. To use the process of applying the SMR algorithm, the median filter a macro has been implemented in the image J macro language. Moreover, the developed macro counts the number of colors in the original image and in the segmented one in order to calculate the coefficient of segmentation, Ksec. The value of the coefficient of segmentation indicates how complex an image is. If the processed image has big areas with small details, for example, the image's containment is not so complex, then the value of Ksec is higher because the segmented image has no number of regions and respectively small number of colors. If the image contains a diversity by intensity areas and a lot of details in it, then the KSEC value is lower because the segmented image contains many colors, sometimes so many than in the original image. The coefficient of segmentation can range between 1 and 256. One means that the image has not been changed. For example, the algorithm failed to segment the image, and 256 means that the segmented image contains only one color. For instance, this could happen when the algorithm does not distinguish separate areas. The following graph shows the flowchart of the macro. It starts with the verification if the input image is 8-bit type 1. This step is important because the SMR algorithm works only with grayscale images. After that, the macro calculates the number of colors in the original image. Then the user is asked to choose the mask size of the median filter and the value for Q, which in all cases is equal to 2. The macro then counts the number of colors in the segmented image and finds the value of the coefficient of segmentation, which is equal to the number of colors in the original image divided by the number of colors in the segmented one. Finally, all calculations are saved as a text file and the segmented image is saved as well. The last specific objective is performing statistical analysis through testing hypothesis and correlation in order to choose a preferred mask size. The hypothesis is tested for case-sake values calculated for every mask size and for the selected levels of confidence. In order to prove the results from the testing, a correlation analysis between the expert estimation and the values of the coefficient of segmentation is conducted. The hypothesis claims that the values of the coefficient of segmentation for chi samples with good quality should fall into the confidence interval, whereas the ones for the bad and very good quality should not. The results are presented in the following tables. For the data processing are defined a strong and a weak hit. The strong one, noted as HS, 
is when the bold values of the coefficient of segmentation for two images of the two halves of G sample satisfy the hypothesis, whereas the other one, noted as HW, is when only one of the two values satisfy the hypothesis. It has been observed that the biggest total count of hits is seven of maximum eight for a mask size 15 and values of level of confidence equal to 0 0.01 or 0 0.05. The maximum count of hits is equal to the number of examined samples and the minimum one is zero. The value of zero for total count of hits indicates that the examined samples have very different structure and they are not a significant group of samples with good quality. The maximum calculated value for total count of hits could be an indicator for mask size selection. Whether this indicator is good or not is examined by correlation analysis. Based on the obtained results, it could be preferred usage of median filter with mask size 15. In order to perform a correlation analysis, the Pearson's coefficients are used because the comparison is between the expert estimation, which is an integer between 2 and 15, and the coefficient of segmentation, which is a number between 1 and 256. The shown chart gives us information that the highest correlation coefficient above 0.85 is absurd for values of the coefficient of segmentation calculated using mask size 15 by 15. The results could be summarized as follow. Firstly, the SMR algorithm is used so that the cheese structure quality to be differentiated. Secondly, the median filter is good for its specific performance of edge preserving smoothing. Thirdly, the evaluation of the cut surface structure could be done via the statistical region merging algorithm and the median filter with mask size 15 by 15. Based on the observed and the proposed techniques for image processing, a method for analyzing the structure of the different types of cheese could be developed. Thank you for your intention. If you have any questions, we'll be glad to answer them.